Thank you for joining us on this special edition of KC24 News. I'm Alex Zambalakian. And I'm Stephanie Barugian. As students and staff get ready for the start of the new school year, the Fresno Unified School District spoke today about important changes parents need to know about. Jennifer Ortega was at the meeting and has more on what the start of the school year could look like. Fresno Unified actually starts school on Monday, August 15th, and the superintendent wants parents to know that they're ready for all the changes. We are thrilled to welcome our staff and students back to our campuses for what we know is going to be a great and successful school year. To kick off the school year, Superintendent Bob Nelson says parents need to double check school schedules. As Senate Bill 328, also known as the Late Start Initiative, will go into effect. Not allowing middle schools to start before 8 a.m. and high schools to start before 8:30. Some bell schedules have changed because Senate Bill, uh, the late start Senate Bill, changed some school start times. So what you thought might be your school start time might change. So I would encourage you to look at that. Unified employees want to assure parents COVID-19 is still on the forefront, but the COVID-19 vaccine is not required. Only the regular school immunizations. That is not required to attend school in our system. It's recommended, and we'd advise, you know, the advisory from the health department is that's good for kids, and we support that, but it's not a mandate. They say masks are available for students and staff, but are not required in the district. We're conscious that we're still in a pandemic, and we're taking every precaution that's recommended uh, by public health. Nelson also says staffing is solid across the board at all Fresno Unified sites. We know teacher shortages are on the minds of many of our colleagues across the state and the nation. We're thankful that Fresno Unified does not face the same shortage of teachers. And while teacher shortages are happening nationwide, the superintendent said school staffing is solid across the board. In Fresno, Jennifer Ortega, KC24, local news that matters.